Hi guys, what's up, Jason here, and welcome back to a brand new FIFA 18 player review on my channel. So in today's video, guys, I'm going to be reviewing 84 rated Inform Jelson Martins. So if you do want to go and pick this card up and try him out for yourself, you'll have to pay anywhere between 9,900 to 75,000 coins on both Xbox One and PlayStation 4. Now looking at some of his in-game stats, he has dark greens in the pace, passing, dribbling, and he has the dark green stat of stamina at 91. So that's been the in-game stats. Now let's get into the review. So now moving into the highlights, the first thing we're going to look at is his pros. Now the first pro I could find with Martins was his pace. Now this guy is so so fast, he has really high agility and really high acceleration and also really high sprint speed so you know you put all those three things together and you've got an absolutely rapid player and you can definitely feel that in game. He will out sprint the majority of defenders what's really helpful even if you're not really too sure how to use skill moves then you can just use his card just to pace abuse on the wing. Moving on now to the second pro I could find with this card and that was his dribbling. This guy has really really good dribbling, um, keeps it really close to his feet and he's really good at weaving in and out players and uh, without getting you no know, dispossessed from the defenders. And now moving into the final pro that I could find with Martins and that was the acrobatic. Now I don't think I've ever added this to one of the, my um, play reviews in FIFA 18 and when I say acrobatic I mean the way like he performs um, skill moves in the air and sort of like he does a lot of overhead kicks um, and a lot of in-air skill finish as you will see from this video. So now moving into the cons, the first con I could find with this card and this is such a huge con with this card and that's how weak he is. This guy is the weakest player I think I've ever used on FIFA, he's just so 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 weak. Um, you know, he just gets pushed off the ball so often and it can get really annoying. Um, especially, you know, when you're in front of goal, you're going to take the shot and then a defender comes and touches him and then he falls over. So now moving into the final con with Martins and the final con that I could find was his finishing. Now this guy is so inconsistent in front of goal. He only has 73 finishing as well and for an 84 rated in form, that is pretty low in my opinion. So what I would recommend to do is play this guy in the right wing um, position rather than a right forward just because he can't really finish in front of goal. So guys, this has been the highlights. Now let's get into the overview. So now moving into the overview, the first thing I'm going to judge him on is value for coins. Now I decided to give him a 9 out of 10 just because you are getting 84 rated in form with a good nationality and a decent league. You know, you can link him up with a few decent players for around 30,000 coins, what in my opinion is absolute steal. That's why I decided to give him a 9 out of 10 for value of coins. Enjoyment wise, I decided to give him an 8 out of 10. Competitiveness wise, I only gave him a 7 out of 10 just because I feel like, um, you know, the weak foot, the strength and the finishing does really let him down. But I feel like, you know, if you know how to use his card correctly then it could be pretty decent competitively scaling wise i'm gonna give him an 8 out of 10 you know overall was a pretty decent scaler um, performed skill moves really quickly what was really helpful um, especially when trying to get out you know tight situations so overall i'm gonna give this guy an 8 out of 10 so guys if you have enjoyed this player review and want to see more fifa 18 player reviews on my channel don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel thanks for watching and see you next time